Hey YouTube, this is Chris again with another one of Tim and Chris's how-to videos. So as you can see, my Skype here, um, I get an error message that says, unable to sign in due to a disk I.O. error. Well, I'm going to help you solve that right now. And there are uh, three things to do, um, three possible things to do. The first one is the easiest one, and I'm going to show you that right now. So if you go down over here to your clock, and uh, you... Uh, show your icons, you'll see the Skype icon. So right click on that Skype icon, excuse me, and quit. Make sure you want to quit, yes. And your Skype will go away. So the next thing we do is we open Skype back up and let's check it out and let's see if I can sign in without getting that error message. And sign in. And there we go. We're now in Skype. All right, so it worked. So that's the quick and easy fix, but if you're still receiving this error right here, the next thing that you need to do is go over to your start and go to uh, control panel. Once you're in the control panel, click on the large icons and you'll find a folder called folder options. Once you find that folder, click on that and you should get this little box here. Then we'll click on view and just make sure that this is checked right here. Show hidden files, folders, and drives. Make sure that's checked, and uh, if, if uh, the top one is bulleted, then make sure that one's bulleted, apply, and click OK. Um, and then try to sign in with your Skype again. And if that doesn't work, then what we'll do is we'll go to Start, and then we'll go to Computer, and then we'll go to uh, Local to C, and we will find users, go down to users, click on that, and then find your name, uh, whatever <clears throat> you named your computer, mine is Chris. So open that up. Next, go to app data, open that up. And then once you're in app data, go down to roaming, open that up. And now we're gonna look for Skype, and there it is. So open up Skype, don't delete this folder. We're gonna delete a folder, but not this one. So go ahead and open Skype up. And then look for your username. Uh, in my case, it's uh, chris.simplehowtos. So what you're going to do is you're going to need to delete this folder. But before you delete the, fo the folder, if you want to keep um, your chat and stuff like that, if you want to save it, um, what you need to do is open this folder up. And you need to save two things. You need to save your chat sync folder and your main.db. Now, you may not see a main.db, but you'll see main. And if you right-click on main and go down to properties, you'll see um, that in the, uh, where is that? Oh, maybe I didn't do it right here. Main, sorry, main properties. There you go. And it's a DB file. That's how you can tell. Okay, so you need to copy this the main and your chat sync. And basically you just uh, put them on your desktop somewhere. You can create a new folder by going fi uh, right click new folder. And then you can grab this one, hold your control and grab your main, where your main. And then you can just copy them or move them however you wanna do it. Open the folder and paste them in there. Okay, so once you have that done, this is if you want to keep your chat and all that stuff. Now, Skype does uh, have a disclaimer that you know um, your all of your chats uh, may may not be there. Some may be lost, et cetera, et cetera. They're just you know covering themselves, I think. But once you do that, once you have all of, um, these folders, if you want to keep your chat or not, then you hit the back button and back to your username folder, and you right click and you delete this. Um, I'm not going to do it because uh, I don't need to, but you're going to delete this file. And then once you delete this file and you start Skype back up, when you go back to your Skype and you start up and you sign in, it'll recreate this folder, this folder for you. And then all you do is once this folder has been recreated, uh, you just open it up and you open up this folder and grab your two things and you just plop them in and it's going to ask you... Um, 
what you want to do here and you just want to move you just want to replace move and replace you want to replace the ones that are there um, and that's pretty much it and that's how you can get out of that um, Skype uh, error unable to sign in due to a disk IO error well I hope this has helped you I hope this has been helpful for you please subscribe please like this video and uh, I hope you have a great day thanks for watching